Okay, listen, did I take Scream 5 super well? Oh my god! Oh my god! No, I'm literally gonna turn it off! No, I did not, but at least I'm able to move on from things. At least I know how to leave things in the past, because now we can watch Scream 6. It is officially time to watch the final movie in the Scream franchise. For now, question- who knows? We don't really- Let's not touch upon that part of the franchise right now, but we're watching Scream 6 today and I'm not ready. I have been having the most amount of fun watching these movies with you guys and I'm so sad that it's coming to an end right now. I'm not- I'm not emotionally prepared. I definitely have to say that I am a little nervous for what today is going to bring just because, you know, Scream 5 taught me that anything is on the table. <laughs> If they touch Gale today, I am emotionally prepared for that. I have mentally prepared myself for anything and everything, so I will be fine if something happens. I'm really nervous, okay? As always guys, if you wanna watch this movie with me um, unedited, uncut, you can check that out over on my Patreon. Uh, all of my other horror movie reactions are over there, completely uncut, unedited for you, if you wanna check them out. Over on Patreon, I also have a bunch of exclusive content. I've got these shoutouts down here if you wanna get those. I'm sending you guys postcards. There is a bunch of stuff over on Patreon if you wanna check it out, it's linked down below, but if not, that's also so fine. But of course, a huge thank you to all of my lovely patrons who have gone over there already because you guys make this possible. You allow me to watch horror movies and do commentary and talk to myself. It's fun. You know what? It's fun. And you allow me to do that. So thank you. Thank you for letting that be my literal job. That's insane. Thank you. I love you. Again, if you want to check out Patreon, it's linked down below. If you don't, it's okay. It's okay. Um, let's finish the Scream franchise, guys. Let's watch Scream 6. The music is, uh... <laughs> the last time? No, I'm not ready. This is a very different you know one? Uh, yeah. setting. Oh, is she dying? Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Uh. <laughs> so funny. I don't think it's funny, is it? This is not the first impression I wanted to make on a college professor. Oh, pff. associate professor, and it's just film studies, so. Just oh. film studies. You're safe. Film studies. That's... Don't insult me like that. <laughs> oh, it looks like there's an alley I can cut through. Is the restaurant near an alley? Uh... <gasps> Don't go to the yes. alley. Yes. Wait, really? Are you sure? Uh -huh. No, no. Why? Why? Stop it. Stop it. Hey. hey, hey. Well, um, wait. Uh, there, there's this is so confusing for my ready or not brain watching her do that right now. Oh wait, uh, I think I see you. Can you can you wave? Uh, the person hey. I'm looking at isn't waving, they're just staring at me. Are you sure? Now they're moving towards me. Wait, whoa! Wait, is Are it not okay? her? Is it gonna oh, be shit. him? He's following uh, me. I no, 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 wait, it's still gonna be- Get out of the damn alley! You teach a class about slashers, and you still walked into a dark alley. For real, girl. <laughs> Now I see something red. Oh, oh, did, oh! They stayed on him. That was kind of sick. That's kind of sick too, but for a different reason. Hmm. Wait, what? Excuse me. Excuse me. Is he a college student? Is he one of her students? Is he gonna die to a scream dude now? A scream dude. Otherwise known as a ghost face. Dude, the, yeah, no, the level is okay. chill. Tara. Right Jason, <gasps> are you and Brad gonna come to the OKB party? Well, if he finishes the Spanish project in time, yes, we will. Is your sister coming? No, Sam wouldn't be caught dead at that party. You're not following okay, the right. formula and it's stressing me out. I am confused and stressed because we're not following the formula. No, he's gonna die. He's gotta die. That's gotta be the twist, right? He's gonna get murdered. Okay, not the whole like Iron Man set up in the closet. Greg? Who's Greg? Please don't be mad. How mad are you? Oh, I'm not mad, Jason. Dude. We said we wouldn't use the voice on each other. 
We said a lot of things. I just want you to tell me why you think you're doing this, in your words. We're finishing Richie's film. That's right, by killing Sam and Tara. Why are you fucking with me? Oh. Where the hell? Not in the fridge. Warmer. Whoa, wait, what do you mean the fridge? Warmer. <laughs> what do you mean? You're on fire. Oh, I did not see that coming. Ooh. We have to finish the movie. Who gives a fuck about movies? Oh my god. The double opener. I've had like a really bad theory going into this film that I don't even want to say out loud. And it fits with what just happened. And I really don't want it to be true. Really don't want it to be true. You've been coming here for six months now and all we've really spoken about is how your sister isn't dealing with uh, whatever happened to both of you a year ago. Mm, yeah, that you thing. You alluded to an abusive relationship issues with your father. Billy. If I'm going to help you, um, I, I, I need you to give me the details. My father was Billy Loomis. And when I got out that I'm Billy's daughter, this crazy rumor started online that I orchestrated the whole thing and framed them. Ooh, cute. I'm sure that was fun. How, how did you stop him? Well, I stabbed him 22 times and slit his throat. And then I shot him in the head. Oh my god. Who was that? Oh, please don't. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> Quinn! Oh, Were we being too loud? Where's Tara? She went to the Omega Kappa Beta party. I begged her not Ooh. to go to that. Do you know if she at least took her taser? I cannot speak to how heavily armed Tara is at this fraternity party. Oh, oh man, I don't know. It's it's tricky. I get it. Sam's like worried about her. Ooh, this cute boy shirtless again. You guys have been checking each other out for months. Why don't you just talk months? to them? Because of staring at people through the window? I'm gonna go find Tara. Okay. You Omega Beta Zeta? No, not yet. But I might rush it. Oh, fresh? Right. I got a bottle of Fireball up in my room. Oh, don't. Tara's good down here. <laughs> Sorry, bro. I didn't catch it. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you did. It's okay. She wants to. Oh, Tara, no! <laughs> Why don't you get your fucking hands off? Get the fucking Get the fuck off! Big bird! Sorry to interrupt. I'm just gonna tase you in the balls real quick. What? Don't ever lay hands on my sister. Oh. Oh. You're out of my life for five years, and then you can't leave me alone for five minutes. Because you're not dealing with what happened to us. I'm not gonna let what happened to us for three days define the rest of my life. I mean, so yeah. Just, just trying to look out for you. I... I know. I know you are. Yeah. You can't do it for the rest of my life, though. You have to let me go. Oh, wait, this entire conversation is like actually pulling up my heart. Oh, shit! Quite a lot, because it's like I get both perspectives of it. After we um, lost my brother, my dad wouldn't leave me alone. <laughs> He even transferred to the NYPD when I got into college, so. Oh my god. Thank you for not letting me go up those stairs. Mm-hmm. I think you're really special. What? Wait, for real? The way that caught a ship in. <laughs> my phone. Damn, girl! I'm gonna go, but get some rest, get sober, and please... Don't kill your sister, okay? She loves you very much. Oh, wait. Good night. Bye. Yeah. That was a really cute moment. Like, it was really cute. <laughs> hey, look at her little smile. Stop. Who is this guy? Don't tell me he's gonna be some weirdo. Wait, do they know each other? No, they don't. Oh. Okay. Straight, it's to the point. Oh, so wait. Might see us. wait, they're already together? Wait, who is that? I know, I know. For your sister and your friends to know that you enjoy physical contact with another human being. Sam! 
Get up here right now. What's the matter? Various ghost face costumes, a character popularized by the stab movie franchise. Oh, now, pack a bag. We leave in 10. Oh my See god. You. Thank you very much, suspicious new gamut. I think we got no. from here. Good night. Get home safe. Go, 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 Come on. Go, 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 go. See you know what I have to say? After the first. Uh, at the first film, the fifth film, I was saying like how like, oh, I didn't really feel super connected to the characters yet and all of that. I already feel more connected to Chad and like Tara and say, okay, they're already getting more character development that I need, more depth that I, oh man, wait, I'm getting attached. That's always bad for me. I can't get attached to characters because stuff like this happens. Oh my God, wait, whose phone is that? Is it Sam's? Who is it? Why did everyone just freak out when her phone rang? My dad wants to talk to you. Hey, Sam. I was actually just about to call you. Well, my sister thinks I'm probably overreacting. Well, unfortunately, you're not. What do you mean? Oh my gosh, she's being framed. I mean, she would never leave her ID at the scene. Come on now. That's an obvious frame job. Come on now, right? What the fuck? I never deleted his contact. The fuck? Who is this? Hello, Samantha. Did you miss me? I'm going to show the world who you really are. A liar and a killer. When Tara better watch your back. You better watch yours. She Ooh. Oh my god! Okay, hi, you're here already. No, just keep running. Just oh god. I don't I mean, yeah, that's fine. Hurry up. You got a problem here, guy? Yep, 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 yep. Okay, step, 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 step. Hey! Oh my god. Not that man whipping out a gun like that. Oh god, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Oh my god, oh my god. Yeah. This is new. This is new. Like, right at the beginning of the movie, Ghostface has a shotgun and is cornered with the two main characters. Who'd have thought? Oh, ah, bye! Okay, Ghostface, big dum dum. Fell for easy trick trick. Yeah, he heard that. <laughs> hey! What's up? Ew, 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 ew. <gasps> Okay, good work! Good work! Boo! Hey, by the way, Sam didn't do it. This was found next to the body at the apartment crime scene. DNA says that it belonged to someone named Richie Kirsch. So, our roommate's dad just happened to pull our case. That'd be a crazy coincidence, right? Yeah. The detective who had the case, he offered it to me because it involves Quinn. So if the man who attacked you did steal your license and plant it next to the body... Yep. It'd probably be somebody close to you. <gasps> kind of true. Friends. Actually, wait, yeah. Quinn, um, Ethan, Annika, all since then. Well, they kind of can vouch for Quinn, so that's one less we have to worry about. Okay, well, can you? Can I help you? Special Agent Kirby Reed, FBI. I work out of the Atlanta office. Mm. You lost. What's with the weird music? Am I supposed to know who that is? Because I don't. We went to Woodsboro High together. She was a senior when I was a freshman. We share a certain history. Yeah. Oh! I'm not she looks so different. Ghostface Killers of 2011. Charlie Walker gave me this. Like I said, I take a- Wait, yeah, did she die? Kirby didn't fucking die? Wait! Oh my god, I don't know. so much to process! I don't remember. We watched her get stabbed and then. I guess that was it. Didn't see this coming. Yeah. Gail Weathers, Channel 4. Do you ladies think you're the reason that Ghostface Killer has come to the Big Apple? Oh! oh. You don't you nice dare! Day, sweetie. Don't I've you this dance dare! Before. Oh! oh. You said you wouldn't write a book about what happened. And then you wrote a book about what happened. Oh, come on. Somebody was gonna write about it. Oh, Gail. What would Dewey think? 
Don't say that name. That's a low blow. Don't so say that. Wait, what did she just say? I talked say? to Sydney. Shit, wait, what did she say? You called me unstable and a born killer. You called me unstable and a born killer. Guys, if my fucking dumb ass theory that my brain is- I'm gonna be so mad if they do the opposite of what they did to me last time. I will not stand for that. I won't, I won't. I, I said I wasn't gonna get mad today. <sighs> but that's when I thought they would... Gail. Now I think they might... The opposite of that. I talked to Sydney. Okay, and what? She sends her love, but she's taking Mark and the kids someplace safe. That's fine. Good. She deserves to have her happy ending. She does. Are you think? I don't, I don't have any interest in you, sir. So if you die, I don't really care right now. Respectfully, don't take that the wrong way, but... Wait, no, if they kill the therapist, that's Where's more that? setting up Sam. You're a day early for trick-or-treating, you know. I thought we already had Halloween. <gasps> I knew it was Ghostface. Ew, 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 stop. Oh. Why are you coming inside? Isn't the job done? Why are you coming in? Like, good job! He's- Oh, you want Sam's file. The way I see it, someone is out to make a sequel to the requel. Oh, God. Step two took place in college. So do we think that the killer is trying to copy the movies? That is oh, one possible. Duh. Whatever mm. happened last time, expect the opposite. Franchises only survive by subverting expectations. If the killers last time were whiny snowflake film nerds with letterboxed accounts instead of personalities, Don't say you can bet the, the opposite. opposite will be true. Don't say the opposite! Legacy characters? Cannon fodder at this point. Usually brought back only to be killed off in some cheap bid for nostalgia. Am I in the friend group? Yeah. <laughs> Am I like one of the targets? Of... Mm -hmm. He's like, wait, shit. Am I gonna die a virgin? Oop. <laughs> but it brings us to our current suspects. Okay. Ethan, the shy, dorky guy who no one suspects because he's so shy and dorky. To be okay, fair, well, I didn't actually, I yeah. Quinn, the slutty roommate, a horror movie classic. Sex positive, but thank you. What if it's literally Gail and Kirby? What if they do that? I'll be really upset about it, but. What about you guys? I mean, I think it's pretty safe to rule out the four of us who went through this last year in Woodsboro. Agreed. Um, not, not really. Agreed. What yeah. if the trauma you That's all true. went through caused one or, or more of you to snap? I mean, face facts. If we're all suspects, you're all suspects. It's true. Everybody's a suspect. It's a freaking scream movie. Another mask was found at the scene. It's a DNA match for Roman Bridger. The ghost face who was directing Stab 3. It's like he's leaving his real life franchise oh. Easter eggs, like dropping the killer's masks in reverse. A countdown. Looks like he's counting down to something. A countdown. Oh my God, wait, so I love this. Nine ghost face killers so far. Last year was Amber Freeman and Richie Kirsch, whose masks we found at the first crime scene, along with the bodies of two film students who oh, killed the professor earlier that same night. Cool. And tell your daughter to stay sharp. Proximity to the carpenters is proximity to Ghostface. Yeah, you would think he would like tell Quinn to be like not around them if he's such a protective father. Why are you looking sus? Hey, Jack, you call the Atlanta field office. Dig up what you can on Agent Reed. See, what if it, oh, what if they do it? What if they make it Kirby and Gale? What if they do it? What if they do that to me? This would be so fun, a little slumber party with the core four. Core four? Yeah. Did you just give us a nickname? Yeah, I know she's my roommate, but you're like the police. Wait. Yo. Quinn. Quinn, girly. Sam, Samantha. I feel oh like, God. oh no, no, oh, they're having, the core four they're having a good don't moment. Go don't ruin it, you no. stupid ass ghost face. Oh, who is that from? <laughs> Ew, this just got very conjuring feeling. Run. Oh, okay. Oh my god. Oh, sorry, Quinn. Nope, nope. Oh, God! Stop! Whoa! Stop that! I don't know if 
you're familiar with a stab. It's in and out. We don't gotta... When we're in there, you know? Don't worry, I got you. No, I don't. No, don't do that. Did somebody call the cops yet? Has anybody made that phone call? Somebody is falling to their death. Somebody is falling to their death. It's not you, but it's somebody. No, she's dead. It's her turn to die. Oh. Oh my god. This is no. Don't make it sad. God, no, 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 no. I don't show me. Don't show me. I don't want to see it. Okay. Oh no. Ew. Holy Jesus. Man, they made that one really like really sad. Seeing her uh what's her name? Chad and Mindy. Seeing Mindy look so like devastated. They made that really sad. Chad. Where were you? Dude, I was in a study hall with a hundred other people. You can ask any of them. Fuck. Make sure you follow through and actually ask them though. Because oh he could God. just say that. He could just say that. You're at the top of my list. That's fair. I had econ. That doesn't really mean anything to me. Oh, that's right. I forgot it wasn't just her. It was also Quinn and- Oh, This movie feels sadder than the others. Like a little less goofy and a little more sad. Both my kids are gone. I'm, my whole family is gone. They took me off the case. But I'm not gonna stop until I find you. Oh, no. You fuck with my family. You die. Are you okay? I came as soon as I heard. Gail, I swear to God. No, truce, okay? I'm Please throw I'm sus on her so then I know it's not her. Nice Can time. you guys be like, ah, it's you, because then it won't be her. I mean, sorry I punched you. Oh, no. No, you're not. I'm not. <laughs> no, 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 no. Please. Guys, I'm like scared. Like, I know there's like, there's nothing here. There's nothing here to say it's Gail, but it's like, what could they do to hurt people? They already killed Dewey. Would they just kill Gail? No, what, what would they get a little more creative and make it? I'm just nervous. I just have a lot of bad feelings. I'm so nervous about it being her that it's like all I can focus on right now and I know I need to like let it go. It's not gonna be Gail. It makes so much sense. Oh no! I know where the masks are coming from. Show me. Ladies. Do you? Herbie? Kirby. Gail. She's with the FBI. She's a child. When did they start letting <laughs> children into the FBI? Jason and Greg were little Atlanta rich boys. Apparently they use fake names to rent this place. All right, I'm dropping the Gail's ghost face theory. I'm dropping it. I'm dropping it. I'm dropping it. I'm just really good at my job. Yeah. Right there. Yeah, we love Gail. I'm dropping that theory because it's bullshit. Yeah, what is this It's place? a movie theater. It's not just a theater. It's a shrine. What? What fresh hell? This looks like, you know, if you go to Warner Brothers and they're like, oh, you like Scream? Well, look at this. But it's in the move. Oh, oh, my mana brain. They've got everything. Wait, these are all the real life things though, right? Or are they the stab Is props? The knife I was stabbed with. <gasps> Don't, don't do that. No, put that, put that back. What do we? Hey, how'd they get all this stuff? Well, cops like money, and evidence can get lost pretty easily. That's a lot of evidence, though. The killer must have found this place before he murdered Jason and Greg, and then he took the masks off the mannequins. All nine, from Stu and Billy to Amber and Richie. How the fuck did it all get here? This is really cool though, I love this. As someone who loves going to movie studios, this is really cool. Cause it just reminds me of that so much. Hot damn, how fucking cool is this place? Fuck no. Fuck yes. Come on Sam, you gotta be excited to get our murder on again. Together, Billy and Sam, Team <laughs> Loomis. I should be excited. ready to slice up more motherfuckers. Sorry Billy, <laughs> maybe not. I didn't mean to get excited about Billy Loomis, but like, it's Billy Loomis! TV that killed Stumacher. If you believe he's dead. Can you imagine? You can still make your own family, even if it's just with one person. And if you lose that one person, 
You just, you keep going. And maybe you find another loner and you look after each other. Don't do that to me! You don't play that song anymore. You lost your privilege to play that song. You don't How'd do you get that. Past what happened to you? Bullshit! You don't do that to me. You don't just spring that on me. You don't spring that on me like that. You don't just play that song. Ow! Okay. I'm okay. get past what happened to you? I almost died after I was stabbed. Yeah, like what the hell? You technically I did die. No way. For four minutes. I mean back up. Did I just hear someone say Stu Mocker is better than you? <laughs> hey Sam. Say Frosty out there, okay? Frosty. We're good. <sighs> this guy is taking his daughter's death a little too well. I know he's just got revenge on his mind, but still. Okay, all right, let's do this. Let's do this. For a mastermind, you're not very bright. Come on. Waiting for me to call, desperately hoping I'm nearby so the police can grab me. Kind of, I mean. I'm a step ahead. Be seeing you, Samantha. He's inside an apartment building halfway across the city. On West 96? How Ooh. did you know that? Whose apartment is that? Gail. No press. <laughs> last time I saw you. Forgive me if I don't trust you to keep them safe. Here you go, baby. No, 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 no. We're in Danny. We're no. from Westside. He can get there quicker. You have to trust me. We've got to make the right call. He's already. Get in. What's she doing? Hey. Hey, get out of my car. It's a cop car. You can't steal a cop car. Oh, God. Okay. No, it's okay. Oh, shit. May I ask who's calling, please? He says it's the killer. <laughs> okay, wait. Wait, actually, I take it back. No, I want Gail to be the killer. Hello, Gail. Fuck! Strange that you and I have never spoken on the phone. Mm -hmm. It never works out for the dipshit in the mask. <gasps> oh, no, but no, they no, certainly no, 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 no. leave okay. a mark before they go, don't they? It's not her. Rich oh, Gail, can you- managed to butcher Dewey. Carved him up like a Christmas goose. How does it feel to know that you weren't there for him at the end? <laughs> Not there to give him comfort. How about you go fuck yourself? You couldn't stop what happened to Dewey. Just like you're not gonna be able to stop this. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, no, 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 Get out of there, get the fuck out of there, Gail, I swear to god. Go, 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 Gail, come on, you're not, they're not gonna do it, they're not gonna do it to me again. They wouldn't, no, 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 that's not gonna work! Nostalgia, fucker. Okay, don't open that door. Whatever you do, don't open that door. You win. I'm in the elevator heading for the ground floor. Sure you are. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, stop. Don't waste all your bullets. You're gonna need some of those. That's why I'm gonna shoot you in the fucking head. <gasps> you have to shoot him in the head. That's why I'm gonna shoot you in the fucking head. Don't. Pulling a Dewey. You would have made a good killer, Gail. I thought she was! You cracking under the pressure and turning into Ghostface. That's what I thought! Would have been a great twist. I would have hated it! Can you hold, please? <gasps> what? No, hi, hi. Please, please stay alert. Oh, what a fucking icon! Oh my god, she's literally so fucking smart. No, 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 I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm not, why would you do this? Oh shit, no, 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 back up, Gail, just leave, Gail, please go, Gail, please go! Okay. 
Yeah. No. Got a weak pulse. Get the backboard. We need to move now. Oh my god, just tell me if she's dead or not. Don't do this. Let's move. Can you just tell me? So I can start boarding. Dewey, it's okay. I'm sorry you had to see that. It, isn't there somewhere like safe we could just hole up in? He's just gonna keep finding us. Great. Wait, so we trust him? We're good. What? We could use that though. I mean we could. We wanna lure him to a secure location and trap him inside. Okay, let's do that. That's actually kind of mm -hmm. smart. Okay, Tara! We execute him. Okay, Tatra! I'm stuck here, but Gail gave us the key cards to the theater. It's got heavy surveillance and security cameras, but we can use that against him. Wait, hey, hey, chat. Oh, God. Hey, 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 guys, guys. Whoa. Let's go. Oh, shit. How are we not making sure we stay together? How did we not do a better job of that? Oh, God, not a subway ghost face attack. Oh. Get your ghost face ass away from me, ghost face. Mm. Yeah, I don't know that he's Ghostface. I doubt he is, right? Come on. No, but that's exactly what they do. They always make it the stupidest one. And not like stupid, but like, you're like, oh, well, of course it's that person. Nah. Are you just gonna... No. <laughs> that was funny. That's a good shot. Oh, I love. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. Take the knife out. Take the knife out. Go away. Go away, bro. Mindy. Oh, God. Shit. Mindy. So it's not Ethan. God damn it. I got it wrong again. Me too. Oh, fuck this franchise. She's strong, she's strong, she's strong, she's got this. So, this is the only way in or out. He steps in through the first door, both doors lock automatically, trapping him inside. Not now. But you're smarter than this, Sam. Grab a weapon and clear this place yourself. Billy. You know I'm right. Now, Billy. Wait, what? Whoa. Excellent choice. No, not her taking Billy's knife. My favorite. Ew. Hello? Get everyone out of there, Sam. You're not safe. I heard from the Atlanta field office. They said Agent Reed's been on a downward spiral ever <gasps> since the Woodsboro murders last no. year. No. What are you talking no. about? They fired Kirby two months ago for being mentally unstable. What? She's no longer with the FBI. How did she sneak into your police department, bro? If they have a lovey moment, does that mean he's gonna die? I actually... Oh no. Yeah, you should have done that a lot sooner. I know. But you could also do it like a lot more times. Yo. <laughs> oh, hurry up! Is that a second? Or is that. Ooh! Okay, wait, he's dying. Holy shit. <laughs> It's not your children. My name's not Ethan Landry. Is it dad? <laughs> yeah, it's his kids. Dad? <laughs> Is that Quinn? Yeah. Okay. I didn't see that one coming, did you? Yeah, because you died. You kinda didn't. So that's why he didn't give a shit. Practice. This guy is taking his daughter's death a little too well. You're a killer. Just like your father. No, I'm not! Yes, you are, you mother! Fucker, you killed our brother! What are you talking about? You said your brother died in a car accident. No, 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 you sweet dumb thing. He died in Woodsboro. At the hands of your bitch sister. 
Ah. I see. So there's You're three kids. family. Damn. Yeah. So you're all crazy motherfuckers. There's a very special bond between a father and his first son, which is why I helped him build this collection. This was all his? We gotta hurry over to the hospital and make sure Mindy and Gail don't pull through. Because everybody dies, Sam! He was a strong, virile young man. He was a limp dick little fuck who cried before I slit his throat. Shut the what? fuck! Oh, 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 it's true. Is that fuck? Ew? You're gonna do about it, bitch. No! Sam! Dude, is Sam gonna kill an entire family? Whoa! Whoa, whoa. Ew. You have to let me go. Oh my god. You have to let me go. Call back to the beginning. girls are gonna murder an entire family an entire family is kind of wild no! No! I was gonna say how do I know that Sam but that checks out <laughs> my father was a murderer yeah. No matter what you think, I'm better than that. She sure loves her overkill, though. But you did fuck with our family, so. That was the end of their movie, and then they roll the credits. That was really, oh my god, I love it. I love that. Thank you for letting me go. I know you could take care of yourself. Aw, big moment. And I called Mount Sinai, and Mindy and Gail are gonna be okay. Mindy's on her way here now. They couldn't stop her. My bad, cute boy. Thanks. They're gonna be okay. Hey. <laughs> are you good? It's just chat. Oh, yeah. That wasn't fair. Hey, we got another one here. Watch out, coming through. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, thank god! Jeff. Do you have the mask? Did you keep it? Sam. Coming? Oh my god. Bye, Billy. Guys, we did it. That was Scream's- Oh, wait, it's done. Yeah, we're done. That's it for Scream. We did all of them. And I'm really sad about it, but it's okay. This one was good. This one was really good. I don't know. There was something about this one that felt very fresh to me and very different. You guys know I wasn't the biggest fan of Five. And obviously a lot of that has to do with Dewey. But a lot of that also had to do with, I don't know, it just felt too similar to the other films. And the characters, like, obviously at that point weren't developed enough yet. So I didn't really care about them. This one felt fresh to me. This one felt like its own thing, like genuinely its own thing. All the characters were fleshed out a lot more and we got to keep all of them. I don't know how that... Chad? Damn. I am actually... Whew, I'm so happy with the killers because I had a lot of bad theories going into this one and I'm just very grateful that they didn't do exactly what I thought they were gonna do to me. 
grateful for that. I like the concept for the killers in this one. I think it was cool. I think it was fun. I never suspected them. I mean, obviously they give you the one guy who is suspected the entire time, which if it was just him, obviously that would be kind of boring, but to have it be his father, AKA the cop and Quinn, who you think is dead, I like that. That Gale scene sucked so bad because you know what they did. They started, oh my God, when they were doing that, they were like redoing some of the Dewey stuff. She was going back in when she could have left and if she died, I never, ever, 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 ever would have forgiven this franchise because if they did that to me twice, both on dumb decisions, I would have been upset. Gail actually survived, which is kind of nice. Again, all of the characters are really likable in this one, like Tara and Sam, obviously. Now, we'll get to that in a minute. Tara and Sam are fantastic. Um, Chad, Mindy, Love them. Obviously you had Gail and Kirby coming back. I didn't see coming at all. I had no idea that was a thing. I thought she was dead. I mean, what I can say about this is I really loved it. I really like this one a lot. I don't know where it falls as of right now in my, like, cause I feel like I had a pretty solid ranking when I watched the first five and now I'm like, I don't know where six slots in. And then obviously we don't, you know, we don't have to get into this right now because we all know. Okay. I don't want to spend too long on this because it sucks. But yes, I did actually film this video like a day or two before the Neve news came out and uh, guys, it just sucks because like obviously, you know, I want to be really excited about it. Oh my god, Sydney's coming back. But we all know what they're doing. Like they're like, oh look over here, we're bringing back Sydney to hide what they did to Melissa. So, so I don't know man, I'm just kind of, uh, I have a lot of mixed feelings as I'm sure a lot of you guys do too. So I wish I was like really excited. I should be really excited. I'm so mad at the people who took the scream joy from us. Um, they suck. Anyway, like let's end on a good note. I'll send you back to, to other girl. It's just me from a couple weeks ago. All I was saying is like, you know, if this is the end of the franchise, I think they have such a solid set. Like, I love this franchise, guys. I love it. I've fallen in love with it. I bought this freaking shirt. Why? Because I love Dewey and I love these movies and I'm so happy that I watched them and I'm really sad that it's over. Like, I genuinely am so sad that it's over. Oh my God, I'm gonna go rewatch all of them now. Um, wow. I don't know what else to say. I just feel like a lot of emotions right now. Thank you guys so much for going on this journey with me. I had a great time most of the time <laughs> and I really appreciate you guys hanging out. Uh, it means a lot to me. So thank you guys so much for everything and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.